Hey guys, um, I wanted to do this video and I just wanted to talk to you guys. This is going to be me being completely real with you. I want to be transparent. That is something that I believe in, um, especially with this channel. I always want to tell you guys exactly the truth in my hair. Like, what is this? Yeah. Um, I want to tell you guys the truth and exactly, um, what I'm feeling with no fluff or sugar coating. I just want to tell you exactly how it is. And I believe in that. I, I'm myself on this channel. This is who I am. Um, and I want to be that. So you guys might have noticed I have taken down um, the daily devotions off of my channel. Um, that's not something I'm going to stop doing. Um, I haven't gotten rid of those videos. So those videos are still available. But they are on a different channel. So I am going to be starting a new channel. Um, I actually started this channel um, about a week ago and put the videos up on it, but I haven't told you guys and I haven't talked about it because I haven't done a lot of new videos to put on it. So I didn't want to tell you until I was ready to just jump back in and get started with those um, devotional videos and all of that different stuff. Um, I have a few more ideas for that channel. Um, so... I definitely want to, um, you know, just kind of separate the two for a couple of different reasons. So I started this channel as a crafting channel. Um, and now, as you guys know, I opened my Etsy shop. So I definitely want to show you guys projects and things that I'm putting on there. Um, I'm probably going to start doing some more, um, some more like I've done them before, um, tutorials on a lot of different things. I've gotten a couple of people that have asked me to do some of those. So I'm going to try to do some of those. Um, I'm going to try to do some more DIY stuff that I did. You know, I've, it's probably been almost a year ago since I've really done things like that. And I'm going to try to kind of shake things up a bit. Um, to be completely 100% honest with you, because again, that's what I said this video is about. I've been kind of in a slump. And um, I was talking to some friends about it, um, you know, within the last few days. And I feel like I've just been in a slump. And it's not just with YouTube or planning or crafting. It's just period. I've just been in a slump. I think that part of it is because I have had a lot going on. You guys know that we're trying to move and we're trying to find a house and all the stresses that come with that. Not knowing if you have a place to live or not is definitely a stressor in case you didn't know. Um, finding boxes and packing things and not really knowing the exact time frame you're moving in. Um, we could move next week. We could move next month. Well, we might move two days from now. Just that kind of thing going on for the past, I don't know, month, month and a half has been really hard. It's been really difficult for me, especially as the control freak that I am. It's been hard for me to come to grasp with the fact that I'm not in control and that's really difficult. Um, so I've been going through that. Um, and then, you know, just all the regular things. Um, me starting this Etsy shop and trying to find time with it, I've been trying to find a whole new way to edit videos, do videos. Um, I've been changing the way that I'm going to edit them, um, trying to learn a little bit more about video editing so that I can bring better quality to you guys. So that's stuff that I'm still growing with. I'm still working on it. Um, I joke all the time. I am the worst um person I know to be almost only 30 years old. I'm not even 30 yet. I'll be 30 in November. To not even be quite 30 years old and be this bad with technology, I don't know anybody that's like that bad. That's worse than me. I don't. I'm really bad at it and I'm trying to get better because I really want to give you guys the best that I can and to do that I need to learn. I need to get better. Um, you know, I really like to say and I hold on to the the whole motto, I don't know, I hate that word motto, um, the whole phrase that um, if you're not learning, you're not living. Living is learning. You know, if you're learning every day, that's how you live life. You live life by learning new things and putting yourself out there. And that's really what I believe. I truly believe that in every aspect of life. I want to learn more. I want to do better. I want to push myself. And that's what I feel like I need to do. Um, so I am going to try to do that. I'm going to try to do some different things. Um, I, I am hoping and praying and crossing my fingers and on my knees praying that we move soon. Um, as far as I know, 
I'm trying not to say anything out loud yet, but I think that we have found somewhere. Um, we will know for certain on Wednesday, so we will see. I really hope so. Yes, I'm hoping yes. We'll see if that's the case. Um, this place does not have a designated craft area for me again, but I'm going to do some things a little bit different. I have a few more ideas of different things that I want to do for sure, and I'm going to change it up a little bit and figure out a different way so that I can have an easier time videoing, filming for you guys, and, and filming better quality and filming in a better area in a consistent place where I don't have to get interrupted. I'm still going to get interrupted. I mean, I'm a mom of small children. It's going to happen, but I can close myself off a little bit better, especially when my husband is home and I can, you know, do better. Um, you know, I just feel like I've been in a slump and I've been a little bit burned out. Do you know, I, I know that all of us get this way, so you guys know what I'm talking about, but I just feel like I have been getting a little bit burnt out. So getting burnt out with some things because, and last week, you guys, when my husband was on vacation, it was wonderful to have him with us, but it was out of my routine. And so I couldn't video when the kids were napping because he was in here watching TV. And I, you guys might have seen a couple of videos where I had to shut myself off in the sink room, which is close to the, it's pretty much the bathroom, but it's a different, um, separate room than the toilet and the shower. So it's just the sink room. And I had to shut myself in there and it's a furnace and I had to try and film in there. It was not easy. I was still getting interrupted. I have three little boys who have to pee all the time. I mean, it was not fun. So, you know, that was stressing me out. And then, you know, just all these different stressors that come in your everyday life. And I need some changes. I need to be better organized with the different parts of my life so that I don't get burnt out with everything. Because I don't know if you guys know, if you've noticed this in your life, but when you tend to get burnt out in one area, it kind of trickles down and you're just burnt out period. And that's kind of where I'm at. Um, I volunteer a lot at church. I've got a lot going on. There's a lot more I want to do. I'm trying to find the time and trying to find a way to compartmentalize everything and better find better uses out of my time. Um, we're about to start homeschooling hardcore. I'm going to do some videos for you guys. I've got some ideas coming. But to do videos, I have to have the time to film and I have to have an area to film in. And so I'm working on it. So I just want to apologize because I truly appreciate each and every one of you. I appreciate the fact that you take time out of your day to watch me. I mean, you know, you see fit to use some of the time that is, you know, you already don't have a lot of because none of us do, um, to watch me and my goofy self. I mean, I really appreciate that. That means a lot to me. And I don't want to let you guys down by any means, but I want to continue to get better. Um, and that's what I'm going to do. So I have a lot of different ideas. I've been racking my brain and brainstorming and doing all these different things and watching tutorials and looking things up and kind of getting a better idea of, you know, a couple of different things I want to change. So it's probably not going to be huge changes overnight because I just don't work like that. But I am going to change. So you might see some small changes here and there and just know that it's because I want to make things better. So there's that. Now to focus in on the whole um, new channel that I have, I'm going to link it down below. It's called um, Creatively Created. Um, I felt like that was a good tie into this channel and what it is. I'm going to do devotionals on there. I'm going to vlog a little bit just to talk to you guys, whereas the devotionals will be centered more around scripture and things that I will probably do. I don't know. I'm calling them vlogs, but I don't know if that's really what I'll call them when I post them. But, um, That'll just be more like conversations just like this where I'm talking about real life situations. It might not de actually be centered around scripture. It might be centered around things that I'm going through personally and just talking to you guys about it. Just little chats. Um, but I have some of those um, and just a couple of other things. Probably that's where um, I'll probably put some more worship videos on there. Um, you know, I like doing that because sometimes you don't... Um, I don't know, you don't run in the same worship circles where you listen to the same worship music, and I might 
have you know listened to songs that you guys have never heard of and if I sing them on here and play them for you guys maybe you'll like that song too and that'll be a different song that you can listen to you know things like that and I just really like to share um, worship is a big part of my life and it's really important to me music is important to me so I like to share that um, and so, yeah, that'll have, that channel will have things like that on it. It'll have things that I just share with you guys from day to day of things that I'm struggling with, things that I've noticed other people struggling with, and just where we can share with each other on there. So it's going to have things like that. Um, whereas this channel is really going to be centered around, you know, it'll have some stuff about my family and things like that, but it'll be centered around, you know, crafting and um, project shares and um, DIYs and things like that and haul videos will still be coming your way so things like that so I I want to give more to that aspect and I feel like trying to put the all of that together in one channel is just a little bit too much so I have thought about it and prayed about it and talked about it with people that are very dear to me and I hold their opinion extremely high and um, with all of that taken into account that's just what I decided to do and so I definitely haven't stopped doing those um, if you guys want to head over there, I will link it down below, like I said, and I'm going to start posting new videos on that channel as well. So um, that's really all I had to share with you guys. I just wanted to get on here and kind of explain myself a little bit. Um, if you've noticed, I've been a little bit MIA and posting kind of the minimum. That's why. I've just been feeling a little bit blah, you know, just a little bit burnout on everything, and I need a refresher. Um, a lot of people start new things in January with the new year. That kind of has never worked for me because, yeah, even though it's the start of a new year, it's the same season we've been in. It's the same weather we've been in. It kind of feels the same even though it's a new year. So that's never really worked for me. I've never really done things like that. Um, a sweet lady that I adore, she starts things when her new birthday because it's her new year, which is hello, completely brilliant, but that's not what I do either because my birthday is um, November the 28th, so it's like Thanksgiving, and then the holidays are right around the corner, so I don't start new things then either because I'll just, it'll be like your New Year's res resolution where you just forget about it in a couple of weeks. That's what it would be if I started it then, um, but when I like to start things, it's fall, and I don't know why because it really doesn't make any sense. Um, everything turns brown and falls off and dies so it's really weird I know I'm strange but I like it because everything feels fresh and crisp and you can go outside instead of feeling like you're about to pass out you start feeling like you can take a breath everything is cooler and it starts to change slowly but surely um, sometimes it doesn't because here in the south we have hot Christmas so I don't know but I've always loved the fall and um, your wardrobe changes, everything starts to change, things starts being different and it's a visual change, you know, with things starting to turn different colors and all the pretty stuff around and I just like it. And in retail, there's tons of things to shop for because everybody's getting ready for the holidays and putting holiday stuff out. And I think that's why. But in the fall is usually where I get a renewal, like a refresh on everything. I feel better. I start coming up with ideas. It's where I can think. It's like fall is my brain food. And I start to come up with fresh things. And so, you know, I have just made up my mind that I'm going to start fall early even though it's hot, I'm going to pretend like it's not. And when I'm inside, I'm just going to, you know, August is going to be my fall starter instead of September. Um, when we move into this new house, I'm probably going to decorate for fall right away. Um, not for summer. I'm probably going to start putting some fall things out. Y'all may think it's crazy, but I just, I need something different. And so that's what I feel like I'm going to do. So anyway, with all that babbling on being said, um, the kids are quiet, so it's making me think of all of these things to just babble on about. But with all of that being said, I love you guys. I haven't given up. I haven't given up on um, my devotional videos. Quite the contrary. I'm thinking up new ideas of things to make that bigger, to make it better, um, to do different things with it, to continue to encourage you guys and hopefully encourage others as well. And um, that will be linked below. So that channel will be getting new videos soon. Um, if I haven't put anything on it today, which I don't know if I'll have time to video anything new today, um, it's definitely going to start back within the next couple of days. I'll have some new fresh things up on there. 
And um, I hope that you guys will go over there and subscribe. And I'm going to be doing some things with this channel as well. So I just want to do an overhaul on everything. And when we move, you know, I, I hate moving, but I love moving in a new place because you get to start fresh. It's a clean slate. You can find new places for everything to go and be reorganized and kind of a reset on everything. So the fact that it's coming close to fall is a perfect for me because that's kind of how my brain works anyway. So with that being said, we're going to start doing, seeing some changes, okay? So definitely go check out that channel below. Definitely check out my Etsy shop. I'll link that below as well because you know what? What the heck? If you haven't checked it out, um, go down there and check it out. I'm going to start putting some new things in there as well. I've been working on a ton of projects, and like I said, I've just been burnt out, so I've kind of been working on um, each project just a little bit and not really finishing any, anything. But you guys are going to see some new stuff out of me yet, so... Um, I definitely love you guys and appreciate you so much. So check, to, check out those links down below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.